A3 right now. So A3, you have to download. You have to come here to download this, assign, this one. All right, I did it for you. You download it. Once you download this, all right, you create again is a window form application. And this window window form application, uh, you will uh, uh, ask user to enter sales amount, uh, 2% for the tax, but you know, nobody have 2% tax, 5%. This is a data from the textbook a uh, long time ago. So uh, I I want it to be more reasonable. So I LA County is 10.25%. Uh, Orange County is 7.75%. So let me run this program with you first. And you will know. Then I'll come back to review for you. For this one, I need you to put uh, three important lines right there. So you're going to put variables. All right. So let's see. Show you. Let me show you. So as I told you, I put a more reasonable right here. And uh, another thing I want to tell you is if you wanted to uh, make your program for both, like show both, you can do like this, okay? Uh, uh, hold on, not here. Uh, you're going to do like this. You say uh, Windows and uh, hold on, right here. So uh, new, uh, new vertical. So uh, I have a, a, a thing from my uh, uh, class. Let me show you right away here. If you go to my, sorry, if you go to here and because a lot of time you probably want to see your program in a uh, different form. So if you go to module here, okay, module here, then somewhere, okay. Then it tell you how do you show right here split Visual Studio screen. That way you can uh, split it. I, that's how you split. That's how I split it. Okay. So once you split these, and let me start to explain this right now. So I have uh, these two, right? So I am going to show you the code right here. I'm going to show you a code right here. So gentlemen, ladies. Before this, you need to write it three lines. Before this, you need to write it three lines. So you're going to create variables. So on this one, this uh, BTN character two here, you double click here, you need to create variable. And since this is inside private, so this is called procedural level variable. You say dim, d, dim, procedural level, right? You know, um, Sales tax usually is uh, contain a decimal point, so we decide to use double. If you want to use double, you have to say DBL sales as double, and DBL LA tax. All right. So if you are better right here, I you want to put the DBL sales tax as counts and put right here too. You can see that. Then, well, one more time here. Now, once you do it here, now. Uh, the sales the sales person here let's see so this one is called DBL sales is that right so from DBL sales tax is going to change to this this variable called DBL sales from here okay so gentlemen let me draw a line for you all right so from here goes to here goes to here from here goes to here you need to use line number nine, line number nine to help you. So you calculate now, after you calculate, is that right? Now you are going to put, you are going to put back to the tax right here. In the LBL tax right here, that's LBL tax. You want to put it back, right? So once you click calculate these, then uh, you are going to put it back. This is put it back. You see the difference? When we go take it and you do uh, try parse, okay? Because it's double, so you should double dot try parse. When you put it back, this is a string. So you have to do convert to string. 
and we also make it to be currency. Do you understand this program? Now, then you do the 2% here, then you do the 5%. A lot of codes are repeated, repeated. So then in chapter 4 and five, chapter 3 later, we need to learn something, create our own procedure. Once we create our own procedure, we can uh, reduce the repeat part, even though it's copy paste, but it's still not worth it. Do you understand? I'm, I'm sure a lot of you will copy paste right here, but even though it's copy paste, that's human beings work. As a programmer, we reduce as much as human beings work and make the computer take over. So I have to teach you a new way to do that. It's faster. It's faster. Okay. Save time. So now let me run this program with you right now. Is that okay? Let me run this program with you. So I'm going to build it. All right. And I'm going to start without debugging. So I have this program here. I'm going to $100 and LA tax is $10.25. And if that's uh, Orange County is $7.75. Your name and your ID right there. Do you understand this program? Yes or no? All right. So if you understand, let me highlight it to tell you what you need to remember. Uh, the most okay what do you need oh sorry uh, let me go back to here right here all right so first of all you must have these three lines before that and you must have this uh, procedure level is dim dbl something like this and have the uh, then you're going to try parts and convert and you realize uh the two percent and five percent really have a lot of work repeated but don't worry as I, I will teach you how to do handle that then you once you finish this you need to submit this work as your name.zip.exe all right do you understand this program i hope you like it i hope you like it okay.